Bridget. I am a PhD biochemistry student at the University of Alberta. Hi, I'm Madeline. I am a master's student in biochemistry at the University of Alberta, and today we're going to teach you about enzymes. So enzymes are proteins which speed up chemical reactions. All of you have over a thousand enzymes in your body helping you survive. When two chemicals need to react, enzymes help them do so. These chemicals are known as the substrates. Today we will be using an enzyme in yeast known as catalase, which produces oxygen as a product. This oxygen can be visualized as foam. So today we'll be using different household items, including um, dish soap, hydrogen peroxide, food coloring, and then baker's yeast to show this reaction. So first off, we start by making this yeast and water mixture by dissolving one packet of instant dry yeast in half a cup of warm water. And we'll set that aside for now. Next, we take our dish soap and we'll add one teaspoon of dish soap to each of the four flasks. Next, we take our 3% hydrogen peroxide and we will add varying amounts to each flask. So to flask one, we add no hydrogen peroxide. To flask two, we add half a tablespoon. Flask three, we'll add a full tablespoon. And flask four, we'll add two tablespoons of hydrogen peroxide to our dish soap. Right. Next, we will add one drop of food coloring to each of the four flasks. And then we'll swirl each of the four flasks to mix. All right, next we will add our yeast solution to each of the four flasks and watch what happens. So to flask one, One tablespoon to flask two. One tablespoon to flask three. And finally, one tablespoon to flask four. Look at the varying amounts of foam we're seeing. This is the oxygen gas from the hydrogen peroxide and dish soap reaction catalyzed by the enzyme in yeast called catalase. We hope you've learned a lot about enzymes today. Thanks for watching!